Good afternoon, everybody. Um, coming to you live uh, from our front porch, 2818 Ream Avenue, Richmond, California. Uh, just took Montana for a walk and uh, just wanted to share a word of encouragement today. Uh, so one of the things uh, I've been reminded of is something that Pastor Aaron uh, used to say to us a lot at Living Hope, a simple phrase that he would say that it's okay to not be okay. It's okay to not be okay. And um, I remember um, shortly after my dad died, uh, a brother of mine sent me uh, a psalm that actually had encouraged him when his father had passed away about a year before my dad's death. And it's Psalm 119, 28. It says, my soul melts away for sorrow. Strengthen me according to your word. Let me say that again. My soul melts away for sorrow. Strengthen me according to your word. Um, it's a very simple psalm, but it became so powerful for me because it gave me a framework uh, from which to pray. That first part, my soul melts away for sorrow, allowed me just to express the grief, the sadness, the pain, uh, the brokenness that I was feeling to the Lord. I, I could be my real an authentic self with the Lord in my hurt, in my pain. Uh, it was okay to not be okay. And then the second part of the verse, though, says, strengthen me according to your word. Uh, so I, I come to the Lord as I am, with all that I'm dealing with, with the things that are very real. I keep it real with Him, but then I ask Him, Lord, would you meet me in the midst of it? Would you give me your grace in the midst of my grief? Would you give me faith in the midst of my fear? Would you strengthen me according to your word? And, and I love that about so many of the Psalms, right? They're, they're written in times of chaos and uncertainty and hurt and pain. And there's room for lament. Uh, there's room for questioning God. There's, there's room for being upset and hurting. And yet in the Psalms, uh, we see that we can lift all of that stuff up to the Lord and then say something like the psalmist said there, but strengthen me according to your word. So I just know that right now in the midst of all of that we're dealing with right now, that some of us are scared. Some of us are anxious. Some of us are lonely. Some of us are discouraged and depressed. Uh, some of us are struggling right now and it's okay to not be okay. And I just want to encourage us to go to the Lord as we are. Bring all of that stuff to the Lord. And then leave it with Him and say, Lord, but strengthen me according to Your Word. Lord, be my refuge and strength today in the midst of this. So just close with a psalm. Psalm 62, 8 says this. Trust in Him at all times, O people. Pour out your heart before Him because God is a refuge for us. It's okay to not be okay. Pour out your heart before the Lord today and trust that he will be a refuge for you uh, in the midst of everything that we're going through. All right, love you guys.